Hey guys, Dylan here. Welcome back to another action figure review. And today, I'm reviewing the Target exclusive Flashpoint, The Flash. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's a Target exclusive. What else do I got to say? And I'm really enjoying this line, you know? It's pretty cool. I mean, the only thing I need now is Flashpoint Batman before I get Wonder Woman. But, you know, that could be dealt with later on. But yeah, it's pretty cool. And uh, let's go ahead and get into the action figure review. The painting and sculpts in this action figure is absolutely amazing. I love the red, I love the gold, and I love the head sculpt. And this body is, I'm pretty sure, is new, right? So this whole thing is just amazing. I love it. It's awesome. It's just, this is definitely replacing Ezra Miller's Flash on my shelf. Because this is, this is the Flash I wanted. This guy, right here. Him. Right there. For accessories, it comes with the black DC Multiverse Stand, which every action figure comes with. He also comes with this card, which looks amazing. You can see his origin on the back there if you want to pause and read it. He also comes with the Build-A-Figure pieces of Cyborg, which I'll explain later. But he also comes with something pretty amazing. A different head! That's right, DC Multiverse. You can switch off the heads without putting it in boiling water or heating it up. And I just love it. Look at that Barry Allen head sculpt right there. It just looks amazing. Now, if you guys are wondering um, how you guys, you know, go ahead and put this thing on, well, it's pretty easy. You just pop the head off. I am so glad they did it like that because, woo, I tell you, man, I, 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 oh my God, I just really like this action figure. I really do. It's just, it's, te it, like, it's so good, man. I can't lie. Anyway, here's the Barry Allen head scope on top of the Flash body, and it looks nice, real cool. And then we have the Build-A-Figure pieces. That's right, this Target exclusive is a Build-A-Figure wave, and it builds Cyborg. I already have all the pieces. I reviewed Aquaman and Superman, who are part of this wave. Uh, you guys can go ahead and check that out. But for Flash, he came with the legs, which is another reason why I wanted him. And now that I have him, I can go ahead and snap on the new legs to the Cyborg body, and I can safely say that, yeah, I'm, I'm liking this. I mean, I do, I, I kind of don't like the fact that he's this big, but in the Flashpoint, he was pretty tall. So I can't really say anything about that. But, you know, it's just nice. I really like it. I'm liking the wave. I'm liking the action figures from it, too. I don't care if they're recycled. It looks cool. I mean, I think the only action figure I don't like from this line is Aquaman. And that's an easy fix, because I can just, I can just go on eBay and just get an Aquaman head and just, you know, pop off the head and... <laughs> put a better Aquaman head on there but um here's the body and it's pretty heavy too it's nice I like it I'm, I'm liking this side I just need the head I just need the head I gotta wait for Wonder Woman but I just need the head to finish this guy off but anyway enough with that let's go into the articulation articulation on this guy is actually not that bad at all like I said I don't know if this is a new mold or old one but it's perfect for this action figure you can get him on running poses pretty damn easy and it, and like the movement and how everything is just it's just amazing I can't there's I literally have no downside to this figure I think the only downside I have is that I I kind of wish they had different hands so then that way we could switch them out. But, you know, like I said, that's it. Everything else is pretty freaking cool. I just, this thing is just amazing, man. Honestly. Like, if I if I went into Target and I saw this action figure next to El, uh, Ezra Miller's Flash action figure, I would have got this one immediately. But now I got both of them and I might sell the other one. I, I don't know. But I'm going to tell you this. This guy is absolutely amazing and i mean it like if they took this body mold and made a reverse flash action figure out of this i would buy it immediately i don't care if it's exclusive i don't care if i have to steal it <laughs> that's not that's a joke but you know what i mean anyway time for my conclusion for painting and sculpts this thing absolutely gets a star it's amazing for accessories even though he doesn't really have any hand that head swapping thing with dc multiverse that's a that's a whole level that's 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 breaking that that's breaking the limits right there and i love it so yeah hell yeah it gets a star and then finally for pricing since it's a target exclusive i believe 25 24 which means this thing gets three stars normally when it comes to exclusives i would say like just be lucky to try to get it or I review it and be like, ah, it's not worth your time because it's different. But this, this guy, hunt for him. If you want a good flash action figure, hunt for this guy because it's that goddamn good. Let me calm down. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for watching. Like this video, give me a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Next review will be Blue Beetles with Ness. We're reviewing two of them. <laughs>